What's up, guys? I'm uh, back on a off a bit of a hiatus. Uh, you know, a longer amount of time than usual between loads, but hey, I got busy. I'm re remodeling a room in the house, and it's a it's a fun project. So, uh, what am I thinking? I know you already heard this on. Well, maybe you didn't. I don't know when I'm going to put these out. What the hell am I thinking? Having a guitar and Giovanni queued up because that's just stupid. It's stupid. Uh, <laughs> For one, I don't have like five hours to do a video and to really pick this part, that's what I need. But I, I, I was, I uh, woke up one morning this week and, um, I think it was Tyler on the discord was talking about just the structure of Giovanni. And, uh, so I really looked, I, I listened to it and I'm like, figured out the chords and like, well, there's actually, you know, there's a lot going on, duh. But, uh, I thought it'd be cool to kind of take a look at it and, uh, figure out some things I'm not, I'm not. I'm not uh, going to do everything in the song. There's just no way. There's just no way. We'll see. I got, there's just some, some simple riff stuff. I want to, I want to point out to you and other things I want to point out, but let's get into this song. Uh, a little deep dive in Giovanni band made. Of course. Something weird going on with chords. She's using a harmonizer or playing chords. behind all this madness is pretty simple so that's cool Before we get into that next part, which is one of my favorite things I've ever heard ever in my ear holes, I'm gonna, oh, I'm gonna do something stupid. I'm gonna try and figure out what Konami's doing. Gotta try it, sorry. Thank <laughs> you. 
What the fuck is she doing? So it goes back to that. <laughs> Good God, dude. It's it's such a weird thing. Why? That's what's awesome. That's what I love about Bandmade in general and Konami specifically. The things she does, it's just different, man. And to figure it out, it's just weird fingerings, weird things to play. And, you know, I can... I can play stuff, but... That's it's an awesome, cool thing. I almost played it right. God damn it. The strings I don't play string skipping stuff very much. I just don't. So when I when I have to do it, I can do it with it. I can do that stuff easy. That's like walking for me. <laughs> then it just goes into this next part, which is just fucking brilliant. So what is right? She doesn't hold on the right smile. Do she tell her? Go, 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 do it, do it, do it. Keep yourself alive, life, 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 life. That is more. I didn't say that. The truth is simple. So when I first heard this song, I'm like, this is, it's, it was a lot to take. It was a lot to take in. And when it got to that part, I, I found myself just like moving, like I don't move <laughs> Listen to music by myself. I was like, oh shit. And I loved it. I wanted it to continue and go on or at least come back to it. And of course it never did because it's, they just don't do that. And it was so cool that it was like, even though the rest of the song, I was like, eh, like I wasn't in love with it. I'm like, this is cool, but it's kind of, it's, it was, I was kind of wrapping my head around the rest, the rest of it. But I knew that that part was coming up each time. So I'm like, we'll get to this part, you know? And, uh, and then I, you know, you can't have that part without the rest of the song. And so the big song just kept growing on me and growing on me. And it's just one of my favorite things ever, ever. Listen to Misa this time. So what is right? She doesn't hold on the right smile. How awesome is that? She just Something like that. I mean, she's just rolling around this. <laughs> it's just so fucking cool. So what is right? She doesn't hold on the right fly. Do she tell her? He can go, live, go, live. Do it, do it, do it. Keep yourself alive, life, 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 life. That is true. I did not say that. The truth is simple. That she has got it on even now.
she's she can take she'll she'll write a beat out for a little while. It's like okay, it's pretty staying pretty constant. Then she'll just do rolls. She'll just do a roll, but it's never it's never like you know. It's just it's never something. I don't want to say simple. I'm not I'm not a like a good drummer, so I don't know. I've listened to a lot of drummers though, and and the thing the things she does are they sound impressive anyway, but then you see her like live and then her uh, solo things on prime plan. And she is the most fucking chill drummer. Oh my God. Like the most chill drummer I think I've ever seen. I think the rev from uh event sevenfold is only like comparable to, you know, I could to compare her to he, he does crazy shit and he's just like, and she's kind of the same way. She's a little more, a little more bouncy sometimes when she does her roles, which is cool because it just looks like she's having fun and she is, you know, and, but she's amazing, but she makes it look so chill and effortless. And that just shows how, how good she is really. Cause I've seen there's drummers you see that sound awesome and you see them and they're, it's kicking their ass, man. And it's not because they're not good. They're awesome drummers, but it's just, it's like, uh, you know, she found the most economical way to do it and she does it and it's just amazing and consistent as hell. It's kind of odd, not odd thing. I don't know. I keep, <clears throat> you can't say what they consistently do or don't. The only thing they consistently do is surprise you. So they, they take the song, which is nuts anyway, and they write out this riff for a long time on the end, but they keep adding something to it every time. The drums get more complicated. There's a little, there's an arpeggio going on behind the already nuts guitar part. There's the do 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 stuff Konami's doing. This the heavy, the heavy rhythm that Miku's doing. Well, whoever recorded, I think uh, Konami recorded Miku's parts for the album. She plays it live, obviously. And then there's an arpeggio going on on top of that stuff. And then they add in the the backing vocals to that rise, you know, literally in 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 notes. But also it brings the song up even more. It's just fucking br 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 brilliant. <laughs> Let's introduce a new riff. And uh, we're going to change again. That's so fucking cool. shame that the i mean i don't know i wouldn't really call it a solo her guitar konami's guitar is buried very deep in the mix it's kind of odd but there's stuff going on so then it goes back into <laughs> she's doing something like that
So the the songs like this, uh, I mean, the big ones, Giovanni and Black Hole, and I think uh, HGK is like that too. Um, <clears throat> they, at first listen, they sound very chaotic. And when you break it down, I'm not going to say Akane's parts aren't crazy because, God, everything she does is a fucking just a level up above anybody. It's nuts, dude. Her normal beats are just awesome. Then she goes into like the the kind of disco beat, which is always fun. But uh, I'm not going to say her stuff simpler than it seems because it's probably just as difficult as it seems, if not more difficult. Um, but for everything that's going on, it's a combination of all the parts that make it sound like this this single unit, a band, you know. And you take one of those things away, and it it takes away from the whole song. There's some music that you listen to, and you can take away the drums, the bass, and you know even the vocals, and you could just listen to it. This, I think. You know, you couldn't do that. You need everything. <clears throat> but I also know that if they want to do this acoustic, they'd, they'd freaking do it, and it would probably make it cry. <laughs> uh, you know, it's an amazing band. Duh. Duh. And uh, it's cool listening to their stuff and um, seeing how how much of a machine it is. I don't want to make it sound uh mechanical but like I, I, a machine is i mean you know like a transmission it needs all the gears to mesh in order for it to work and it's just awesome you know and for for just you know stuff like uh for rhythms and things konami writes without a care of what skill level miku has 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 brought herself up to yet she doesn't care she basically says hey here's what it is you can do it <laughs> and miku's like okay and she just brings herself up to that level. It's fucking awesome. And, uh, you know, I love him for it. So, hey, that was that. I hope it was <laughs> worth watching. Uh, it's the Giovanni Deep Dive. So, uh, I'm going to move on to the next thing, guys. i got to get a bunch done. I've been lax. I've been, I've been lazy, but not. I've been working. But anyway, I'm going to uh, move on to the next uh, video. Thank you.